Zack Snyder, you're the man. You're the best comic book do comic book movie director ever. Chris Nolan is a hack. The Dark Knight trilogy are three piles of dumb shit. Uh, Batman v Superman and Man of Steel are superior to every single shit pile Marvel movie ever in existence. Thank you, Zack. Thank you, Zack, for staying and putting your vision, which is basically the comic book vision, bringing it to life. See, WB, you need to ignore the noise, because the stupid haters, they're Marvel retards. They weren't going to like Man of Steel or Batman vs. Superman anyway, but guess what? Man of Steel still made $668 million, and Batman vs. Superman has $862 million, so yes, <laughs> it's like, you know, it's like a... A Marlins fan isn't going to like the Yankees no matter how much you try, but Marlins are still a baseball team. DC, you're going on the right track. They're stupid people like the Marvel Tards. Like I said, been, Marvel Tards have been beaten severely since they were kids, so they, they that's why they're Marvel Tarded. They are. They're just stupid. They have extremely copious amounts of shit tape. Marvel, the, the, the shitty taste of Marvel fans knows no bounds. They're as bad as Chris Nolan fans. But yes, Batman v Superman ranks as one of the best Batman movies and best Superman movies of all time, along with Man of Steel. Batman v Superman, superior to the entire piece of shit Nolan trilogy. Oh, and there's, see, Devin Fukarachi, I don't trust him. There's a rumor about... The solo Batman film having every Bat villain in it, I wouldn't mind that, but it's, it's from Devin Fukarachi, so I don't know if I trust it. I, I wouldn't mind the Bat, but I want Robin and Nightwing, all those characters in it too. But thank you, WB, again, Zack Snyder, the right man to carry the entire DCU. We're getting Zack Suicide Squad, Zack's Wonder Woman producing all them. He's the right person, to the right person that you should stay with. Nolan, Nolan, Chris Nolan was never good. He was shit. He was force feeding his garbage. He was basically a Marvel fan directing Batman movies, which is horrible. That's why they came out shit. Like I don't care how much money they made. All three of those movies were pieces of shit. I don't give a fuck how much money. It's like you know Marvel tards. They like shit like Iron Man three. There's no discerning for shitty ass taste like that. Like Iron Man three made a billion, but it was a piece of shit. The Dark Knight trilogy. Two of them made a billion, but they were three pieces of shit. They were garbage. Batman v Superman and Man of Steel Superior's entire Nolan trilogy. Thank you, Zack Snyder. Thank you, thank you, WB, for bringing Zack Snyder into the fold. And fuck you, haters. You're useless. You're pathetic. And you're a waste of time. DC is steamrolling shitty Marvel, and we keep on going. The DCU is going on as planned. And like I said, Alfred and the Justice League, of course. We're going on it. DC is off to a great start. Like I said, it's uh, it's better than Marvel's start. It, it, uh, the first DCU movies, Man of Steel, Batman vs. Superman, combined made a billion uh, compared to the combined 600 million of Marvel's first Iron Man 1 and Hulk 1. <laughs> so you're already off to a way better start than shitty Marvel when they started. Fuck Marvel. Thank you, Zack Snyder. Thank you, WB. The DCU is what I want to see. I want to see Batman, but I want to see Batman, Superman, Green Lantern, the whole DCU. That's what I want to see. I'm a true DC fan. Not these fucking posers that just want to see Batman and no one else. Fuck the haters. I love Batman. I love Superman, but I want to see DCU, Supergirl, everybody in action, Batgirl, Robin, all of them in the DCU. DC rules. Marvel sucks. Eli is retarded. DC out.